I'm going to do a reaction video to Justin Waller and his lies. You know, he says that he broke up with Miss Louisiana in college and all every girl in the school wanted him and they were slipping him numbers. It's just typical Justin Waller nonsense. I'm going to show you some pictures from his college days where he looks like uh, Chucky and a Cabbage Patch had a baby and he came out as the spawn. You know, it, it, the reason why I go after Waller is because he supports the Tates and everything they do, and the Tates are human traffickers, pimps, and pedophiles. He also pushes the real world and their war room. And in the war room, uh, the chats have been intercepted by police, uh, you know, that they're openly teaching young men how to human traffic teenage girls and profit off of them. And Waller's part of that because he profits off it, profits off it also by every person that he refers to it, the Tates give him a cut. So I'm going to uh, make a video every day in Justin Waller and Andrew and Tristan Tate's honor uh, talking about all their criminal activity and we'll go from there Have you ever been heartbroken before? Fuck yeah, Once, and you know what many times hold on did you see that reaction? How, like the he had, did you ever have you ever been heartbroken? And he's like, oh yeah Like everything is an act and a con with him like everything like even a reaction he knew the question was coming and he's like putting on a show. It's like if you can't read that, there's something wrong with you. Here, look at the face. But yeah, I've been yeah, like here we go. Try to act like you have real emotions, Waller. I know it's tough. Times so twice, twice. I broke my own heart twice, and I'll tell you why. Yeah. So this is exactly broke his own heart. So of course college, he did. He's in love with I'll use college. I did the same thing in high school. Mm -hmm. College, I'm dating Miss Louisiana, right? She's getting ready for Miss America. I'm Hold on. This is the face of Waller in college, and he claims that he was dating Miss Louisiana. And the old football excuse will be, oh, he was playing football, so he's playing at a heavier weight. He, that's an excuse, and he knows it, okay? Mr. Waller here didn't get a better look. He, listen, Mr. Waller was a virgin until he became a millionaire. So we'll, we'll just go from there and let the video play a little bit, but just, just typical lies. I'm 22. In my head spin, man, I got the volleyball team looking at me. Sure, you, know, you all did. All the cheerleaders, girls sure are sleeping my number in class. And I didn't want to be a piece of shit. And I thought I was broken. So I super, super tried to grab religion. And I'm like praying. I'm like, God, please don't let me do this. Because I was going to, instead of instead of cheating, sure you would. Sure I was going to just break up with her. But I'm praying to God. I'm like, God, please do not let me make this mistake. Please, please, please. It didn't work. I broke up with her. I graduated from college. It's 2009. So you broke up with her. I broke up with her while she's getting ready for Miss America. She's crying on the floor. She was like throwing up and shit on the floor, like in front of me. Mm. Don't. This is the face that claims that a girl was on the floor throwing up for him. I'll let that sink in. So look at the picture. Have some fun. On Mr. Waller's expense, always making a fool out of himself. Do this. Don't do this. She went on a cruise for being Miss Louisiana, which I was invited to and did not go. And thank God she met a six foot four South American basketball player, one of the most handsome men I've ever seen in my life. You know what's funny about Waller? He's always giving off his stats like a female. Oh, I'm six foot four. Let's talk about Justin Waller before he became a millionaire. So he he claims that he had all these benefits and he was just so much better looking than everybody. And he, you know, being six four or this and that. He wasn't a good athlete. He wasn't good looking. He wasn't getting any females at all. He could say what he wants. It's a lie. We all know it's a lie. Okay, you look at the pictures. He wasn't getting any action in high school. He wasn't getting action in college. You know when he got action? You know when 6'4 finally benefited him? When he became a millionaire, when it didn't even matter. So prior to be him being a millionaire, the stats that he likes to give did absolutely nothing for him. He wasn't getting girls, and he wasn't a good athlete. So... um you know, he he he, lo he loves to give off his stats like a female. So let's go from there. Uh, and it was just enough to peel her away from me when I tried to. I was trying to get her back. And I'm 22. I don't know anything about this. There's no Rolo Tomasi. There's no Tate. There's no Jay Waller. There's no Mike Thurston. There's like I had no. <laughs> there's no Tate. Wait, there's no Tates around to give you information out of human traffic uh, teenage. According to the Tates. Uh, any female that's like over 16 years old that um, her vagina is used up and she's dirty and she's unclean. So in order to date the Tates at this point, you have to be between 13 and 16 years old. Yeah, but, uh, you know, Andrew and Tristan Tate are great relationship experts. And then, of course, since Mike Thurston's given the interview, he's got to, you know, 
you know, make him feel important and make himself feel important. Yeah, we needed Waller, a guy that didn't get laid until he was a millionaire, uh, to tell us uh, how to pick up women. But let's let him talk. No information. And I was completely He's like, mm -hmm. heartbroken. Yeah, all right. And I graduate college and I'm digging ditches because there's no jobs. In 2009, three billboards of this woman with the Miss Louisiana crown on on the way to work. And I'm driving in my beat up pickup truck. And I'm just like, fuck my life. <laughs> I was so. You know what I think? I think that he was driving the truck, uh, driving to work in his beat up pickup truck, digging ditches. And he was probably looking at that billboard and thinking to himself, I'll never have a girl like that. My life sucks. And this whole story is just his imagination of when his life sucked. And then he finally did something where it worked out for him and he became a millionaire and he got on obviously three or four different types of steroids. So now he thinks he's good looking. He'd piss so hot that the cup would melt and he knows it. So he's full of shit as usual. So bro, I've never been so low. It was, it was horrible yeah, because was I thought so I was going to get a college degree and have a job, you know, have a good job. Didn't. The girl I loved, I broke up with her because I wanted to be a good guy. Sure. Because I thought that was what I was supposed to be. And I had turned to religion and failed. Mm -hmm. All in the same, let's say, six months. Oh, it was absolutely horrible, bro. And, you know. But, but how did you, so what, how did you use that? Like, did you do something productive with that pain or did you just literally oh, lost God, it? Oh, God, I'm cracking up laughing. Well, you take it on the chin, right? But you always keep fighting. Yeah, yeah. just keep fighting. You know, maybe I was out on my feet a bit. But I stayed training. Mm -hmm. I stayed working out. Um. Funny enough, about five years go by, she married this guy, she calls. Mm -hmm. And then like, you know, six months would go by, she'd call again. Then three months, and then it started sure to slow gap. Sure, she just fire, couldn't get fire, over you. Know, you. Smaller and smaller and smaller. And, uh, were you yeah. replying? I did reply. Yeah, sure just, you did. Like, the first time I it happened, reply. it was a text and my stomach dropped. Sure. Because she was the one that got away from me, right? Mm -hmm. Because, not, not because, it's not like, like I didn't mm, move on. Yeah, okay. Yeah, sure. But it was it was this climactic part of my life. She was on the big stage. I went to Vegas, watched her at Miss America. I thought I thought I got her back. Didn't, you know, it was like this big ordeal, right? But um when she when she called back, you know, I remember my stomach dropped. Somebody give Justin a glass of water. His mouth is drying up from all the lies. It's okay. Just give him give him a drink of water real quick. I know where I was. Like, it was important to me at this time. I was probably 25, 26, something like that. Yeah, yeah. And um, spoke, whatever. But I knew she was married. And then she ended up actually lying to me and said that she got separated and moved back down with her family. And I started seeing her regularly. Yeah, sure, Justin. And, uh, yeah, you know, that's the story. Obviously, we were sleeping together again. Found out she was still married. And they had, they were separated, but they were, you know. Mm. You got to watch that, man. I've actually have had that happen to me twice. And there's no telling the dude that, you know, hey, bro, sorry, but she lied to me. Bullshit. All right, whatever, G. You know, whatever. Yeah. You know where I am. Uh-oh. Here we go. At Vistaprint, we can get your brand into your customer's hands. Or so just typical Justin Waller made-up stories. I mean, we couldn't. I would love to be able to talk to that girl, the so-called Miss Louisiana. That was probably all in his imagination on a billboard. But that's just that's just typical Justin Waller, you know, always uh, making him sound so self sound so. He was always good looking from day one. He was always that dude. He was never that dude ever. Okay, until he became a millionaire. And when you're a millionaire, all of a sudden females don't, they don't care if you're five foot tall or seven foot tall or if you're fat, if you're skinny, if you're in shape, if you have abs, they don't care about any of that because you're rich. And when did Justin Waller start getting females? When he became rich. Uh, the money and steroids and uh, you know sports cars and fancy clothes, they work wonders for ugly dudes that somehow finally got it together.